<laughs> He's figuring his math out for uh, spacing. I think, I think I figured out 11 inches. For my 11 inches. Okay, now. <laughs> so, if I make that ten and eight eighths. Ten and what? Eight eighths. Don't oh, she? <laughs> ten and eight eighths. Very funny, dear. It's 11 inches. I know. Minus 8 and 3 eighths. I see what you're doing. Equals 2 and 5 eighths. I see what you're doing. You're making that into a fraction for subtraction. Making yes. a fraction for subtraction. Yes. Da 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 da. Now I gotta divide that one, two, three spaces. Oh boy. Well, now wait a minute, you're not gonna have them all in one line. Three spaces. Oh, okay. I, I get you. Okay. Each edge in the middle. Each edge in the middle, I get it now. You gotta have a space here. I'm not in your spot. I'm not thinking the way you're thinking. Okay. So, <laughs> two be sixteen. He loves me. He really 16, does. Sixteen and five is twenty-one eighths. Okay. By that, by three is seven eighths. So I go seven eighths between each one. Huh? Between each one, or on each edge and between them. Yeah, yeah. I got it. Quite a ways from the top. top. I'm getting my sides. I, I see. Okay. I'm gonna stay up. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> He's getting the sides measured. He'll do the top when I shut my mouth. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <coughs> he loves me. He really um. does. <laughs> I'll quit shaking the table. <laughs> Two, three, four. <laughs> five. <laughs> and <laughs> there. You okay? Yes. Okay. One, two, three. Let's do it this way. Let's do it this way. I laughed so hard my lungs had to clear out. <laughs> That's nothing bad. No. Here we go. He's ready to start blooming. This is our youngest daughter, Nina. <laughs> a little story about her name. Yeah, we had quite a bit of talking about what to name her when I was expecting. And it seemed like I'd like the names that he wouldn't like and back and forth. We wanted her middle name to be Marie because that was his grandmother's first name and it was his mom's middle name and my mom's middle name. So, finally, I had been watching a show and the name Nina came up on there. And, of course, in Spanish, that's Nina, as you probably know. Or, if you don't, now you do. <laughs> so, we decided, okay, we've got our daughter, last daughter's name. So, when she got into school, she learned about Columbus and the Nina, the, 
the Nina, the Pinta, and the Santa Maria. And she come home from school just devastated. And she said, Mom, you named me after a ship? <laughs> I said, no, honey, it means beloved daughter. Beloved, that's what you put on gravestones. <laughs> I said, it doesn't only mean that. Uh, we finally convinced her that she was not named after a dead ship or a dead person. <laughs> And, oh, <laughs> we can laugh at it now, but it wasn't funny to her at all at that time. I said, honey, you've got a beautiful name. <laughs> it means that we love you. You are a very beloved daughter. <laughs> and she finally got it. But, you know, when you're, what, seven years old, it's not quite so easy to take in, <laughs> especially right after Columbus Day which is tomorrow, in case anybody wondered. I only know because Joe's got the day off and I couldn't figure out what holiday it was. Columbus Day. Columbus Day. And I know there's some dispute over that, but as long as he gets a day off for it. I don't care. That's right. <laughs> as long as he's getting a day off for it, we don't care. So what if he landed in Florida or one of those places down there? We will acknowledge that the first ones here were the Inuits. Native Americans. Huh? Native Americans. Yes, Inuits. Inuits. The first to occupy. Yeah. And some scholars have figured out where this and that particular ones probably came over from or hopped over the islands from. That was before anybody told them they couldn't, that the world was flat. They didn't know it, so they just came and went anyway. <laughs> and for your flat, for all the flat earthers out there, I'm sorry, I'm on the other team. We have a round world. A spherical word. I'm just making trouble, and I, I don't think I'll get in trouble for that. Not tr trying to be contrary, I am just saying. <laughs> I believe in God, I believe the earth is round, and I believe there were island hoppers before anybody ever told them whether the earth was round or flat or anything. <laughs> And they were here first. But it seems like land is something everybody fights over. Right? Eight inch off. What? Eight inch off. Eight inch off. Oh boy, dear. Just erase the mark. I could. <laughs> I don't have any racers. Then you won't know. Well, there's got to be a one around somewhere. Just ignore it if that's possible. You won't see it after you close the book. No. But I won't close it till tomorrow because that glue's got to dry. Yep. Yep. All right. Now He's I, so agreeable. Now I got to remeasure because I got to come out. I'm trying to remember how much distance there was between them. Well, I forgot. I was worried so much about lighting, I forgot to turn on the camera. But here is the finished product. I gave her a bicycle. She's She brings cupcakes to all of the holiday get-togethers. And the kids, absolutely, everybody loves them. So, because she, she, she likes to heap the frosting, too. And so, 
he grew up on a farm so we gave him a little cow down here and she's she's a uh, she's not a frilly girl but I figured she deserves some flowers so the little message on this one is I could just squeeze you so tight <laughs> now what mother wouldn't want to say that of course I've liked the messages we've given all the kids so I'm hoping I'm hoping when I rewind this or when I download it upload it when I upload this to the I'm hoping all of this shows up really well so far we've been doing okay so anyway I hope everybody enjoyed this please subscribe Click that notification bell, da ding da ding, and give us a thumbs up, and we'll see you tomorrow. Have a good one. Good night.